Welcome back to Spider-Man PS4. We're going to the lab. Actually, we're gonna do this the fast way. So we can build... Something to destroy. Or just stop. Doc Ock's tentacle arms. Since Peter helped Otto build them. He's the perfect candidate for the job. This is your last chance to upgrade gear and abilities before the end of the story. Are you serious? Look at this. I've got all the stuff I need. I've upgraded the gadgets enough. I have all the skills. What do you want from me? Yeah, let's do some collections and stuff to do. Like, how many newspapers? 17. What's the... Um... The whole... The whole number. Is there a trophy for the benchmarks? Hope not. I know what I'm doing. Come on. I know we're getting to the end of the story. I am prepared for it. And I'm excited. Because today is October 4th. Tomorrow, we're going to be, or at least I am going to be watching Venom in the theaters. You did the impossible, Doc. But now I have to destroy it with a little creation of my own. Oh, snap. Is it made of the same material the arms are made of? The first thing I noticed immediately that the eyes look like the Raimi ones. They look like the Sam Raimi lenses. Spider-Man 3 reference, the news, a uh, lady showing Venom and Sandman, holding me to beg? MJ hostage. Not gonna happen. <laughs> the world will know the truth before they mop you off the pavement. Damn. Tell them what you did. I... Never. Oh! Everything you have is built on lies. Lies. Ah! Oh! Uh, 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 those are some fast reflexes. I mean, those arms are incredible. But... You stole my company, my ideas. Now, the truth. The truth. Okay. The truth is, you were only ever worth a damn when you worked for me. The truth is, you could never accept that I'm better than you. You're a failure, Otto, and you always will be. Whoop. Oh. 
Look how happy he is. He survived another day. Give Barely. Me the Otto, you've worked your whole life to help people. You're fighting the wrong man. But have it your way. We don't Holy. have much time! Please! I'll turn over the anti-serum when Osborne pays for his crime! Fuck! I was not ready for this. Man, they're fucking fast. Just give me the anti serum. You've already done enough to ruin Osborne. No! He always bounces back. He has to lose everything. Oh, oh shit. I cannot, I, I can't change my power. I don't want this power. Damn. The floor is lava. People are dying. They need the anti-serum now. I will cure the city after I bring down Let me save the city, then we can do whatever you want! I already know what I want, now get out of her! Shut up. Give me the anti-serum, and I promise Osborne will face charges! Liar! Just like Osborne! Nothing but lies! Come on, amazing Spider-Man flashbacks. When the lizard broke the web shooters, this is another one where he kind of broke the tower Such a, a little bit. Parker. You knew? I tried to warn you, Peter, but you didn't listen. New. I won't let you win. This means too much to me. Not more than it means to me. Man, Peter is really angry. When I say really angry, I do mean really angry.
He's pissed. No. Can't you see all the people you're hurting? You'll never understand. You haven't suffered like I have. Fuck, I don't have web. I forgot. You should be on my side. I love. This is a cool fight. Shit happens, you know. You look tired, Parker. Not tired. Just hurt. If you want to change the world, you have to be the kind of man who can make the hardest decisions. <gasps> I couldn't agree more! I saw you as a son. I should have known you'd turn on me. Just like all the others. Turn. Turn? I've worshipped you. Your mind. Your conscience. Wanting to help others. The way you never gave up. That's because men like us have a duty. A responsibility. To use our talents in the service of others. Even if they don't appreciate it. We have to do what's best for those beneath us. Whether they understand it or not. No, you're wrong! You are everything I wanted to be! You just threw it away! Yes, of course. You're right, Peter. Oh. I see that now. The neural interface affected my mind. But I can fix it. We can fix it together. If you'll help me. Do everything I can. I'll make sure you get the best help. No! If they put me away, they'll take my arms. I'll be trapped in this useless body! Please, Peter. That wasn't me. You said you'd never abandon me. You promised. Remember? Uh. 
And of course, you rest easy, knowing your secret is safe with me. You do what you think is best, Doc. It's all any of us can. Peter? Even when it hurts like hell. Peter, where are you going? Peter? That's a great finish. I mean, it's not... I'm pretty sure there's still more, but... That, that was really strong. That was incredible. Insomniac know how to make a great story. Still viable. We'll need the entire sample as a base to produce more doses. How long will that take? A few hours. Maybe a day. What if we use it to cure someone right now? Then there won't be enough to cure the others. That sucks. I'll give you a few minutes. Was that my PlayStation just now? You're gonna be okay, ma'am. I've got the cure right here. Take off your mask. I wanna see my nephew. You knew? I've known for a while. I never wanted you to worry. I did. And I am so proud of you. And Ben would be too. All the people you've saved. I don't know what to do. Yes, you do. That's horrible. That's really horrible. Believe it or not, I'm in tears right now. Oh my god. What a finish. What a story. I'm speechless. He was so close. He gave up on the person closest to him to save millions more. Shit. 
Yeah, it's what you deserve, man. You brought this on yourself. There's nobody to blame. So? Hi, Mary Jane Watson, associate editor. Congrats. Thank you. I knew you could do it. <laughs> what about you? Find a job yet? Oh, no, but, uh... I'll be right with you, honey. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I was actually considering maybe a career change. Hmm? Yeah, I think I might want to become a chef. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, it's... You're a scientist. A good one. Yeah, the last Great project morning. I worked on, I created a monster octopus that almost destroyed the city, so... Yeah. I mean, you do make a hell of a chicken curry. <laughs> I do. <laughs> Still working on my dumplings, though. Going camping? Oh, uh, my uh, new place isn't going to be ready for about a week, so I'm going to be crashing with Miles for the next few nights. Oh. You know, you can always stay at my place. Only if you want to. No, I, I mean, I mean, I mean, yes, I mean, no, no, I don't I not want to, but meaning I, I, I do want to, but only if you do. I never stopped wanting to. Just make up already, yeah. goddammit. Final. God damn it. About fucking time. Oh man, that was. Whew, that was amazing. Uh, like I said, Insomniac know how to make a hell of a story. Had ups and downs. And had a spectacular finish. And I'm pretty sure that like every Marvel thing right now, uh, there's going to be a post credit scene. Oh. Man, I'm, I'm serious when it's here. That finish. Uh, I didn't see it coming. It was... Oh, it was great. I really hope that uh, Insomniac can work on a sequel. Because it's gonna be... It's gonna be awesome. How they gonna do the next story? The other possibilities of villains that they can use. I I, I want them to continue working on Spider-Man. I want to see what they can do and how they can push the series. You know, because the only continuity that we've seen was in the movie license games but they had no choice there well this is an original story and it's gonna be awesome if insomnia continue to work on spider-man and get uh, along with marvel so we can see where this original story can go how far can it reach i really want to see that happen I really hope that now that everybody sees how awesome Insomniac really are and what they achieved with this game, they'll be given a chance to make another Spider-Man game, which can continue this story. I, I really hope so. Oh, we just have to wait and see. Oh man. I'm I'm speechless. Not many games this year, you know, really grabbed my attention. And God of War and Spider-Man were the highlights. With Venom coming in theaters tomorrow it's gonna be fucking great oh man I'm just gonna wait for the credits to roll
and hopefully we can see something else. I'm not an expert or anything, but I think it's of the course. Way that you ask her. I'm getting too nervous. <laughs> hey, all right. So where do you want this? Uh, right over here is fine. All right. Hey, so Pete. Yeah. I uh kind of got to talk to you about something I can't tell my mom about. What's up? Well, um, weird things have been going on. Like, physically. Oh. Oh. Uh. Well, you know, you're at that age where, where your, your body starts to change. And so you may be noticing some areas, no. for example. No. Not that. Uh. I think it's. I think it's better that I just, um. I show you. I show no, you. No, 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 no. <laughs> It's pretty weird, right? Not that weird. That's how you're gonna reveal it, your Spider-Man. Really? A couple of ideas that I wanna hand off. If and hopefully Insomnia get a chance to make a sequel to this game. I really hope that I don't have to play as Miles. Call me old fashioned, but as I mentioned in some previous videos, Miles is the reason I hate Ultimate Spider-Man now. And I loved Ultimate Spider-Man, I had the whole fucking collection and because of him I sold it I was ready to throw it out till I actually got a call that somebody wants to buy it I loved it so much I had every single issue. I didn't miss out on any. And because of Miles, I got so mad that I wanted to throw it away. I don't even have the full collection on the Canon 616 Spider-Man. I have it around issue 600. And I don't even have them physically, I have them digitally. But for Ultimate Spider-Man, I wanted to have the real thing. I wanted the real experience. And because of Miles, I lost so many great memories. I mean, Ultimate Spider-Man was amazing. It had a great story from start to finish. If they ended it, with Peter's death, I would have been happy. I was not happy that Peter died, but... He was replaced by somebody who clearly did not understand... The meaning of Spider-Man. Miles Morales was a character rushed in... Fucking pushed in everybody's face. Why? Peter Parker is Spider Man. I don't care about anybody else but Peter Parker. And some people would say, well, Peter Parker is in everything. In every movie, animated series, always Peter Parker, Peter Parker. Well, there's a fucking reason for that. There's a reason. 
that it's Peter Parker. There's a reason that Tony Stark is Iron Man. And there's a reason why people love those characters. People want Spider-Man to be Peter Parker. He is Spider-Man. Tony Stark is Iron Man. It's not the costume that makes the character. It's the person behind it. No matter who you put in the Iron Man armor, nobody's gonna be better than Tony Stark. No matter who's behind the Captain America mantle, there's nowhere a living person better for the role than Captain America, Steve Rogers. No other. I am really disappointed with the decisions that certain people make. You know, and I don't want to hear you're racist. I have nothing against the color of Miles' skin. He could have been Chinese, he could have been purple, he could have been orange for all I care about. I would still not like him. You know? As well as it doesn't matter to me if Black Panther is a white dude behind the costume or it T'Challa. I don't care. T'Challa is a great character. That's why I like him. I don't care who's behind the suit. If it's not T'Challa or if it's not Peter or Tony. I don't care. As well as I don't care who they put in the symbiote. If it's not Eddie Brock, I don't care. And I'm really hyped for Venom tomorrow. I'm I get worked up about things like this I care about comic books man so stupid I don't want to say anything. Anything I say is just going to sound, you know, pretty fucking stupid. Because you can say I'm biased. I don't care. I mean, come on. That's why I don't listen to new music, because it's not good. Oh shit, my controller disconnected, that's not good. Come on, man. It's not like people don't like changes, it's just... Uh... When you change something great and make it awful, people see this. They notice. We are not stupid. We are not sheep. We're not gonna take wherever 
you throw at us just because we're fans. We're not just gonna consume it without taking our time to dissect and see every little detail. That's how it is. I grew up with comic books. And not only Marvel, DC as well. I grew up with comic books. My childhood revolves around comic books. And I still read comic books. And I hate when the writers do something stupid. Because as fans who follow, we see every small change. And we're gonna call you out on it if you do something that doesn't fit the character. We know them as well as the writers. Probably we're even more familiar with the characters because different characters are written by many different writers so there's some inconsistencies here and there now I don't want to ramble on because I'm getting worked up and I'm just gonna wait you know quietly for the credits and see if there's another scene hopefully you know because I waited in the theaters after Infinity War because I knew there's gonna be something I've been watching Marvel movies for more than 10 years they always have post credit scenes that's what I learned when I go into the theater tomorrow to watch Venom in the end, I'm still going to wait to see the post credit scene. I'm not going to get up the f of the fucking chair until I see the post credit scene. You're not going to play me like that. Are you fucking serious? Oh my god. Okay, I admit it. I'm fucking dumb. How the fuck was I supposed to know? They don't tell you this shit. I mean, I could skip it, but I don't know if it's gonna skip the credits. And the post credit scene if there's one. I just don't want to risk it, that's all. I didn't know you can do that. Give me a hint. Tell me that I can use the left stick to scroll down. Oh my god.
don't do me like that. Come on. Seriously, how's I supposed to know? I mean, usually with other games, when I finish it, I skip the credits. I don't care. But this is Spider Man. I can't. God damn it. Now this this is something to look upon. Can I go up? No, but I can slow it down. All right. Additional thing, man. So many people. Alex Ross. Great man. Great man. All I can say. The combined work of all these people brought to us an amazing game. I am grateful to all those people here. Because what they did is a game that will set a new bar for future Spider-Man games. People were skeptical. They said, well, it looks like the Amazing Spider-Man 2. It doesn't look good. Well, the game is amazing. great game the story was amazing the gameplay in memory of Steve Ditko who with the stroke of his pen made this world amazing true that a gray man At first, I didn't believe when I heard that he died, but apparently it was true. See, what did I tell you? What did I tell you? never learn, do you, Norman? We were so close. But I'll keep trying. I will find a cure. Is this Harry? I will. Is this a symbiote? I love you, son. Okay, that answers my first question. This is Harry. But is this a symbiote? Yes, it is. So they're setting up Venom. That's good. But I don't want it to be Harry. Harry's a great character, but I don't want him near Venom. Like I said... Eddie Brock is Venom. If you don't get that right, don't touch Venom at all. 
Congratulations, you have finished the main story, but the adventure continues. You can now change the time of day in research stations. Good luck. Thank you. New suit. Ah, oh, we're definitely gonna stick up with this suit. And this piece of shit. Look at this. Complete all main mission side quests and reach 100% district complete. Completion in all districts to unlock this suit. Fuck this suit. I like this one because the eyes look like the Raimi lenses. I like it. I don't want the power though. And now we're gonna start buying them or crafting them to get the trophy. We don't have enough base tokens? What? I was pretty sure that everything was fucking calculated. I was sure that I've calculated everything and I'll have enough. Well, I guess we're gonna have to do some bases. Actually, I think this is a good place to actually end the video. Don't you think? Okay, so I wanna thank you all for watching. This has been an amazing game, a great experience. I am pleased that I had the chance to play this game and if you want to see more spider-man videos because all these stuff on the map we still haven't fought taskmaster so we'll, we'll have to do that I'll play all these outposts bases challenges everything that means more videos will come So stay tuned, subscribe to the channel, click the notification bell so you don't miss out. And hope I catch you all in the next awesome Spidey video. 1043. Oh, Escaped come on. prisoners have seized a civilian bus. Officers needed in Gramercy. Please copy. Hi, how you doing? I think that's a great finish. You're 